Next, let's make multiplication work. So we have a test case here for multiplication that I want to make pass next. We can test and make sure that it does fail right now. Indeed, it does fail. So now we'll go back and basically redo the same work that we did for plus, but with multiplication in order to implement it. I'll go a bit more quickly through this. I now have a multiplication operator for my binary operator type. I'll have my lexer return a times token when it sees the asterisk character. I'll add a new part to the expert parsing rule here, which says what to do with times, and that's to return a multiplication. And I'll finish by adding a branch for pattern matching of multiplication to reduce that operator. I didn't get a warning or a to-do from my compiler here uh, because I did have a catch-all case here. So that's why it's dangerous to have those sometimes. Now our multiplication test should work. Yay, it does.